Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zlot, and we are here today on the Iron Man Season 6 series. Um, so, I'm, uh, uh, why? Okay, that was just weird. It was some weird funky lighting, that's all from the sun okay uh, so this is an unofficial um, entry so to speak I'm just playing alongside the competitors uh, practicing for season 7 which is coming up which I will be a competitor on anyway today let's um, first of all I want to throw up some some solar panels and stuff so we're gonna put the solar capacitor we'll put that in the generator room here I don't think it throws off any uh, radiation but just just in case now let's see is there a panel that kind of looks like the front of it yeah we'll put it there uh, let's see let's go stand in front of it and nothing yet but it's not receiving anything from solar panels so oh let's turn this guy off right oh hey let's well it's not actually cranking out anything is it so I don't really know let's just turn it off for now <laughs> I, I still haven't uh, done the testing to see how much energy that thing actually uses apparently it's a lot <clears throat> okay uh, speaking of what is our fuel down to? Almost none. So let's... <laughs> Good thing I looked at that, eh? Have my plants die on me. That's why I want to get these solar panels up, because it's going to reduce my fuel consumption by quite a bit. Okay. So let's get these up. Um, hmm. Is my drone going to reach? Let's see. Oh yeah, of course it does. I got up here and put... Hey, I got a plant monster down there on my island. Hey, buddy. I want your sprouts. Okay. Uh, let's throw these out. So I'm just going to do the horizontal. I played with these a little bit, and I, I have the best luck with getting... The most energy out of horizontal ones and now I'm just gonna spin this and I gotta cover as much surface as I can so let's get these in here okay um, is that center? Oh, I'm off center by one. Off center by one? Okay. It's not a big deal. I'll just... It'll be off center by one. Whatever. Actually, off center by a hell of a lot more than one. Off center by about three. <laughs> okay. I don't care. And we got eight left, eh? Hmm. Spin it. Uh, five left. Five left. Hmm. So the sun is going to be coming up over there. That's going to get all shadowed. So let's stick them out past. A little bit. So if we go there, there, come on, oh, come on, ah, oh, right there, and we'll just spin this one. Yeah, we'll give it some sort of symmetry, at least it'll be. Not all jagged and funny looking. 
Uh, that's not too bad. That doesn't look that bad. Okay, so... Uh, my understanding is... The green light is its potential. And the yellow light is what it's actually pumping out. So it looks like it's not going to have very much potential. I guess I'm, I'm assuming that's because it's cloudy? Is it? It's a storm. Yeah, so... I'm guessing that's why, because we're not actually getting much sun. Now, having said that, it is getting power. So let's take a look at how much it's drawing in. It is currently bringing in 272 kilowatts with cloudy, and my consumption at my base is 122, so I'm actually charging up the capacitor at this point. So I'm not using fuel. I've stopped using fuel because this is taking care of it. Uh, and I'm actually charging up the capacitor. So when, when I stop getting any solar power, it'll start using the capacitor battery until that runs out. Then it'll start using fuel again. So my fuel should last me quite a bit longer now. Oh, you can see it went down a bit. I guess it's gotten really cloudy. It's halfway through the day already. Okay, well... I'm probably not going to actually seal this up. I don't see much of a point. It's not that... Uh, the... It's not that the environment is actually really doing much here on Akua. It's not hitting me hard. It's not really... It, it, it's not an issue down here at water level. It seems that it's not going to get cold enough or hot enough or radiated enough or anything like that to actually cause me distress. So, eh, my vehicles can get wet. Whatever. I've done worse. Hell, I've crashed. I've already crashed this into the lake a few times on purpose. Okay. So, today... Let's move this out of the way. And power this up. Get in a third person view. And we're just gonna scooch this over to get it out of the way. Don't wanna block off access to the door. That should give us room. That should be enough room. Enough room to trick this puppy out. So, I have a whole bunch of gear on me that I want to put on it, including some hardened steel blocks in the front. What I like doing with my hover box is okay, first of all, let's um, repair what I can see is damaged, because, you know, let's not be stupid and cover it up with trash stuff that I can't then get to unless I have a repair bay, right? Right? <laughs> okay. Uh, not to say I haven't done stupid like that before, because, you know, pretty much all the time I do. Oh, actually, I don't need to do those blocks, because they're going to come off. Okay, so the first thing I do is I remove some of the pieces off this first to prep it. And I'm going to disassemble the harvest module, the spotlights, and the front blocks here, the curved blocks. Okay. So, now it's ready to receive my love and my love consists of some hard steel yeah some hardened steel that's my love for it first of all we're gonna plaster hardened steel all over its face well not all over its face but just 
very strategic spots. I don't have much of this. I looted it. This is where I'm going to be shot at the most, you know? <laughs> okay, I only got two left. Ah. Eh. Stick them down in front of the hover engines. Okay. And then we'll just put regular blocks in for the rest of it. Now, what I like doing is I actually like putting an entire second shell around the hover box. Come on, get in there. Ah! Uh, Really? What the heck is that? This thing's going to go flying up in the air in a second because of derpiness. Okay. Let's do my drone. It's a little easier to get into these nooks and crannies. It looks like I need to do some repairs here. So, get that repaired up. Okay. Okay. that on there and then come on this up here come on thank you and over here I just leave all the old stuff on I don't bother taking it off there's no need to don't really have to and, oh, didn't do that one far enough. Okay, so I didn't bring this all the way up to the top because I want to actually make it a little bit easier to get in and out of. I'm going to be putting um, slopes. Let's drag this across. Okay, and then in the front here, same thing. Once I get some more Sathium, we can upgrade the uh, all of it to hardened steel. But in the meantime, the front of it's not a bad idea because that's where it gets shot at the most. Okay, so let's put these corner pieces in. I could do a symmetry axis, I guess, but there's, we already have unsymmetrical stuff back here. I guess I could true that up by putting something in. Uh, it's not a bad idea, really, at this point. Okay. So we're going to do a symmetry plane. Why here? No. There. Okay. Okay, and then what we want to do is we are going to let's change the block type to this round slope. And Okay, come on. Turn that, oh, and then flip it up like that, and we'll just bring this out to there, and then three more, one, two, and three, okay, and then we'll get our larger hover engines. And these are the key to stability, let me tell you. Right there. Now that should have... Yep. Okay, good. Okay, we'll switch back to our blocks. And this should still be on the corner, on the slopes. Yep. And we'll 
we'll just bring this out three. And then we will do the top. Uh, that I'm actually not going to do with a slope. What I'm going to do is, or corner, or whatever, I don't know what, what's this called again? It is a slope. It is a slope. Okay. Uh, and then we put it here. Okay, and then we gotta use some uh, regular blocks here. And we'll just fill that and put those in. Okay, so that's the front pods. And we'll just put one right there. A straight block because the lights are gonna go on top of that anyway, which we can actually do right now. Uh, this will be curious. I want to see what happens with these angled spotlights with the... So we're going to put a regular one there, and then we're going to do these angle ones. Oops. Like this. Let's see what happens. Oh, it did it right! Nice. Okay. I like that. Okay. Good. Uh, so that's that done. Let's get the back pods in. And we still need to put a bunch of the generators and all that, but we can do the, we can do the pods. Um, and thrusters. There we go. Let's get the thrusters. So the thrusters, we're going to put two down here. Facing back. Think of this back thrust, or, well, to propel us forward. And then for front brakes, we're going to just flip one. And I can just stack it right on top. Sure. Okay, so that's our front and back thrusters. And the side-to-side -side ones are actually going to be in the back pontoon. So let's put that in. And so we're going to do curved block here. Like that. And then one, two, three. Get this engine in. <clears throat> and then the other side, we're just going to flip. Nope, not like that, like that. One, two, three. Uh, and then from here, we just put regular blocks. Two, three. One, two, three, and four. Okay, good. That's all filling out correctly. Good, good, good. And then from here, this is where we actually put the thrusters in. So one there and one there. Now, did they actually go in the right way? Yes, they did. Awesome. Okay. I don't remember the symmetric, the, the plane working so well before. I remember stuff not going in correctly on the other side. Um, it wouldn't go in the, the opposite orientation sometimes. I don't know. I just, I had troubles with it. Okay, so let's get these rounded slopes back on. Two and three, and should we do rounded? Well, we'll do it at least to this block. Come on, two and three, and we'll just do solid blocks in here. Fill this up. 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on. There we go. And there we go. So that should be those rear pontoons. Uh, you can even put guns on this right now. So we're going to put these uh, minigun turrets. Now I want the front ones as front as possible on it. And then I want the back ones as back as possible on it. Okay. Now, we need to put the rest of this gear in here. So we got these generators to go in, fuel tanks, and RCSs. So let's get these generators in. We can stick one there. And then the fuel tanks we can lay on top. And then one right there. Yeah, that'll work. So, uh, or will it? You know what? We can flip. We, I got a better idea. We're going to do it here. Like that. And then we're going to put one there. And then the RCSs can go up top here. And right there and there. Okay. Um, <clears throat> what else do we got to put in? We've got the oxygen. Did I not make? Really? Okay. So we did not make an armor locker. So let's do that. SVHV armor locker. Um, I'm going to make another fridge. So the oxygen, armor locker, fridge, and we can do another cargo box. And then we're going to need a shutter door. Now, do I have that in blocks? No, I used that. Okay, so we'll make a shutter. Okay, let's grab this. That, that. And that. There we go. Okay. So, actually, at this point, because this is all individual stuff, it's not going to work on the cement, the, the plane anymore. So, we're just going to get rid of it. What? Come on. N, symmetric plane, and N, is it not, um, okay, so, what, do I uncheck that too, symmetry plane, none, oh, <laughs> yep, got to check that too, uh, okay, and then, hmm, Constructor. Hmm. I'd actually kind of like to move the constructor out a bit and those thrusters. Yeah, so let's make sure nothing's in it. Okay. So I'm just going to pop that off. And these thrusters. And I'm going to pull those blocks out more. So I'm going to put just regular blocks in here. And then I'm going to put this gear in. So let's put the constructor and thrusters back. So we'll do the thrusters first. That's one, 
two and three, and then uh, the constructor. Oops, had it on the right plane. There we go. And then the other stuff. So the armor locker. What's that? I want it facing the correct way here. There we go. And then the O2. And we've got cargo and fridge to go in. So let's do... Um, Hmm. So the oxygen here, and I want that upside down, so let's flip that. Well, that didn't work, so if we flip it like this, there we go. Okay, and then, so do we just do, that's one, two, three, one, two, three, we could do, I'm just contemplating where I put the grate down to. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. Um, what I can do is I can go fridge there and then large cargo box like this. There we go. And then we fill that in. And we put on a grate. Okay, so let's put blocks here. Um, hmm. Do we put block or do we put. No, we put this. We put the slope. And then we. We should um, let's do some sort of angle thing, like yeah. Okay, so let's yeah. Yeah. Let's bring that across, and then. I do for I could do uh, is this gonna look okay if I do that? Maybe. It's kind of trippy, some funky angles. Or do I do more conservative? And I don't think there's a block that'll fit there, is there? No, I don't think there is. Actually, yes, there's something I can do with that. Uh... No, uh, I'm not sure if I like that either. <sighs> not really liking this. Okay, so what about just a half cube? Yeah, that'll work. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. And then we put the grade on. Every time I, I upgrade this thing, it's, it's really organic, and each one is a little bit different every time I do it. It's kind of cool. Okay. That works. That works. That works. We're starting to get some shape to it. Uh, well, it's completely functional right now. It's a little bit exposed, and I don't like that, so we're going to deal with that. We're going to bring the 
Now, do I move it all the way back and up, or do I... You know what? I think we're going to do something funky here. Let's try... No, I don't want to do half slopes because I'm potentially putting a turret on there and it'll be floating in midair if I do that, so... It'll look wacky. Let's do... Let's just do... Let's do this. And we should be able to uh, run out and grab the the bits when my base destroys the drones that are incoming. Oops. Okay, so regular blocks. Come on. So what do I do with this stuff here? Do I do I continue? Do I let's see, do I continue with this? Right there? Yeah, I think I do. That's a little trippy looking, really. And then, so we'll just put regular blocks in here. Okay, and then, what should we do coming out of here? Um, do I put a half? Do a corner thing. Maybe something like this. And then huh. I don't think I'll be able to put a light on that, will I? Uh, about... So that is something like... Like that? Right, I had it the right way. Okay, so now... That's kind of interesting. Ooh, three of them. Nice. Grab some more fuel. And that means I need to get this puking out fuel. So, uh, let's get that puking out fuel. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. That'll make a hundred of them. Okay. hundred of the larger ones. Oh! Jeez, something... I can't believe I almost forgot. I 
Actually, you know what? Let's let's not piss around. Let's just go get the. Uh, <laughs> let's go loot these before they disappear on us. Okay, this thing's gonna be much faster and more stable now. Woo! And oh, actually, before I let's group and then. Turrets! Ah! <laughs> okay, stop! 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 <laughs> You're wasting my ammo. Okay. <laughs> Stupid thing. I don't like my turrets shooting Predator. It's just... I don't need it to shoot down predators. Just wanted to take on aliens. Okay, so jump out. Whoa, 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 whoa. I must be stuck. Yeah, I was stuck. <laughs> uh my gun. Just just because. Come on. Drone. Thank you. Bullets. Really? Bullets are bullets, I guess. The other one fell through the planet, unfortunately. Because I didn't really need to uh, move, because this was actually close enough for my drone to get to. That's okay. Wow, that was not the greatest score, but it all does add up. It all does add up. Okay, so what I wanted to do, before we were so rudely interrupted... Oh, I gotta make sure the base has enough fuel in it too. It's got fuel right now, but... Let's just jump out. So, the base has... Uh, it's drained its battery now, so... How much time do we have left? we still got a long time to go before the daylight comes back, so... Yeah, I'm gonna have to put fuel in this. Bummer. Bummer. Eh. Yeah. Okay. Well, that should last us a while. Uh, there's, there's, there's that. That's actually a lot of fuel. I, I put way too many fuel tanks in this place. I should actually pop one out. It's deceivingly too much fuel. Hmm. So, can I actually access this? No. No. Okay. What's all this doing? I should actually check these. Good. And keep the water coming. And excellent. Keep the oxygen coming. We do have to go into space, so oxygen is going to be important. And we're going to be going into space actually pretty darn quick. But Today I just wanted to trick out the HV and and really, I mean, I guess we're done tricking it out for the most part. The, um, oh, I could put, yeah, let's match that up. So let's put our light on and drone it up. The drone has better lights on it. And then we will, so that was that block and that block. Okay, so, uh, okay, and so it's on that one already, and that was on that side, so we flip that around, put that there, and then it was 
this. And that goes there. And then, hmm. Do we have, like, spike coming off of it? Yeah, I think we do. I think we absolutely do. That one. And then the spike for that one is right here. Okay. Okay, what does that look like? That actually looks pretty hot. <laughs> I like it. Not bad. It's okay. It's okay. I mean, it needs a paint job and texturing. I don't even think I made it. I don't even think I... Did I even... Do I even know how to make those? I don't even think I took them yet. Texture tool. I don't know how to make a texture tool. Well, I've got the points for it. Oh, fine. Let's unlock the multi-tool. The texture tool. Um, what else? Yeah, the sniper, of course. And the T2 sniper. We'll, uh... Hydrogen? Yeah, we might as well start looking at getting that going, too. We... Rocket turret? We don't really need that yet. We can do the cockpit blocks because that's good for the SV also which we should probably take all this stuff come on and come on what's going on unlock and then oh there well that was weird it wasn't letting me I, I don't know I don't know uh, and I probably will upgrade all the thrusters to thruster jets on the SV. What else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Let's look at the capital vessel stuff. Oh, a medic station. Yeah, that's good for both base and uh, O2 station. Cockpit block, whatever. Uh, minigun, we'll do that. RCS, yes. Thruster. Medium thruster. Come on. And T2 fridge, sure. That's constructor, yeah. Hangar door, why not? door yeah we're gonna want armor doors too and three points left can't really do much with that I've already got a furnace but that's okay and meh three points do I have anything that I can take those three points taking the armor uh, portable work light okay I don't think there's anything worth one point as a... In the, no. Okay, there we go. Um, so, now that we've determined I actually took the tool, I can make it. <laughs> uh, okay. So... I need to get that advanced constructor from the civil hub. I really need the advanced constructor. Then I can make the uh, T2 multi-tool and some better weapons. <clears throat> I can make uh, I can make more missiles to get the because right now I can't do anything with the magnesium powder that I have or the magnesium the magnesium I can't refine into powder so I'm kind of screwed. Uh, yeah, so Advanced Constructor is... I'm going to need that. That's a need. That is a need now. Okay. Uh, can we upgrade anything? Yeah, we can upgrade our pistol. So let's do that. We'll throw that in here. And... We don't have a rifle upgrade kit. Too bad. Okay. 
make the pistol. I'm going to get more kits, obviously. I have a bunch of laser kits. Yeah, I get to use those at level 25. It's a good thing I found them when I was level 3. Okay. Um, is that it? Okay. Let's put the stuff in here. And we're going to put the stuff away. So we go into the food processor to put the water away. We go into the fuel 2 cargo box to put the O2 away. Actually, I'm going to keep 15 out on me. Actually, you know what? Let's make that a 50 slot because I'm going to go fill up both vehicles here. So let's fill these up with oxygen. Ooh, almost out of fuel on him. Well, actually, not really, but yeah, let's put all that in there. That's fine. Okay, and fuel in the bus. Or oxygen, I should say. Okay. Okay. Speaking of fuel, how's that doing? Getting there. Getting there. Get the Slummy down. Okay. Well, guys, I think this will we'll call it um, here. It's getting a little long in the tooth. I don't want the episode to get too long. So, um, off camera, I'll texture this up and. We're going to take it out to the civil hub and smash the civil hub. I'm going to grind a whole bunch of levels, I think, at this point. Because I'm currently only level 13, and I'm going to need... Well, I need level 25. I just... I need level 25. There's certain things that I'm going to need that I can only get when I'm level 25. So, yeah that's our goal <laughs> that's our goal grind 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 but uh, oh I should make you know what I'm gonna do I'll make a bunch of harvest modules for this thing too I'll make some more I'll make two more so we'll make one two more and I'll put those on the front three wide and we'll just we'll just go around and slice everything down with our harvest modules and um, go for the easy mode no risk XP resources and food <laughs> yeah yeah I they're gonna nerf the harvest module eventually they're gonna make it so that you don't get XP that's that would make sense to me that would make sense although it is a weapon like I guess like shooting a um, a gun, but shooting the gun expends resources a lot more than what the harvest module does. Har harvest module just expends a little bit of energy. Um, bullets ex expend actual, you know, metal and other stuff. So okay, well we don't need to sit here and watch this craft up. Well, guys, if you like the episode, uh, like and subscribe. If you want to be notified, make sure you turn your notifications on for the channel when I upload the next video. And the next video will be probably, because I'm going to off camera, I'm going to go smash probably both those POIs uh, a little bit <laughs> and take their stuff. Um, and then I think next episode we're gonna we're gonna take this thing up to the moon or something because I hear there might be magnesium on the moon so 
we're going to take this thing up to the moon and, and see if we can uh, get some magnesium and maybe some other, you know, maybe some more cobalt. Um, yeah, I think that's our, our goal because uh, we need to get this thing weaponized. Also, uh, I'm going to ca talk to Captain Odonis and find out, or Adonis, if uh, when we're allowed to start warping to other sectors. Um, he hasn't specified when, so I guess we'll find out. And then once we can warp to another sector, I'm going to try and go get all the stuff I need for uh, for my CV, for my basic CV. But I can't do that in this sector uh, unless I unless I go farm drones. I guess farming drones all over the place. I could farm them on the moon. I guess if I looted everything on the moon, but I can't because that's not part of the mission. So I'm going to have to actually mine all the ore, which is kind of trippy. Okay, guys. Um, next episode to the moon. Until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.